Good morning, guys. David here on SNS. It is a beautiful morning out here at Port Mansfield. I got out here a lot earlier today, about two hours earlier than last Sunday. So hopefully that cooler weather will get us on some fish. Beautiful morning. Daylight is just breaking. So I'm going to change my setup here. I haven't landed anything yet. A couple of bites, but missed opportunities. Uh, I'm going to go ahead and put a little redhead jig on here. I brought my nail clippers because these work awesome. They've become part of my tackle. Awesome for line so I'm gonna try the watermelon AM lure on a red jig we'll see how it goes guys so. alright so we're gonna go down a ways and um, Caught a little trout. He came off the hook before I brought him in the boat, but he was too small to keep. Um, so we're just gonna troll these little lines as we go. And I'm gonna go about another hundred yards and then we're gonna work our way back and uh, see if we can land something. Beautiful day. The water is awesome. So that's four now, four little undersized, I think four. And so we're gonna throw a couple another a couple more lines out and see if we can catch anything bigger. If we if we don't land something bigger in maybe 15, 20 minutes, we're gonna go ahead and move along. These little guys are really beating up my bait here. Alright. Alright guys. So that last that last cast I think nailed me my first keeper of the day. Alright. First one is strung up. Alright, good deal. So we're not going home empty handed. That's Always great. Okay. Let's get back at it. I'm going to hit that same spot where this little slot trout came out. number six here but only one keeper so far so it's been pretty fun this time around I'm definitely gonna ping this little spot <laughs> and it's it's actually nine Alright. He's an undersized guy. Alright, where's 
still here at that same spot. I don't have any intentions of moving. As long as these guys keep hitting this bait. Something's on. changed my battery I was gonna stop filming for the day but I changed my battery because I threw this guy on and we've hit got hit by two monsters I brought out the net because I lost the two that I brought in so I have the net out now and I'm whispering because boat stop right next to me <laughs> so my stringer slipped out of my hand because I just caught another keeper <laughs> and it slipped out of my hand I was able to save the stringer but not the fish so I lost two trout two keeper trout right now and it's getting a little hot, so I'm hoping maybe I can catch at least another two keepers to take home. I was hoping to hit my limit today, but we'll see how that goes. All right, guys, so I've got myself a keeper, so I'm not going home empty-handed as long as I can hang on to this fish. I don't drop this stringer again I can go home with one but we got some time so we're gonna keep at it and we're just gonna stay to this spot I can see where the drop-off where I came in so you know I, I estimate it take me about I don't know 30 minutes to get back so and they are on fire right now they are fighting such a fun day. Even with that little mishap. It's all good. Alright guys, so I did land a second one. I went ahead and strung him up already. And we're going to Got my line back as quick as I could. I'm back on this watermelon with a redhead. And it is working just fine. They're beating it up. I've already gone through one. I might have to change this out. It's been an amazing day. Um, we had, I had a, I landed probably something like 20 to 25 fish, something like that. I, I wasn't keeping track, but I'm sure it was a little over 20. Uh, we missed a couple keepers that, you know, big guys that didn't make it onto the boat. And then I, I lost two, my first two fish. Uh, stringing up the second one I lost uh, the second and the first one because I lost a hold of my stringer luckily I caught my stringer and I was able to get these three afterwards I landed three keepers after that so that's that was great don't get don't go home empty-handed today at least uh, but it's been awesome like I said I'm, I'm a novice kayaker and obviously fisherman out here just learning and you know I, I'm learning from you know Facebook groups and and YouTube channels and my own experience coming out here and so it's been it's been an awesome time I love doing this and I can't wait to 
come out here again. So uh, I'm gonna start kicking a little harder so I can get in uh, quicker. So I'll see you guys next time and drop me a comment. If you guys uh, like the video, hit like, subscribe. If you haven't already subscribed, hit the subscribe button uh, for more on kayaking, fishing, and DIY with SNS fishing. I'm David. We'll see you next time.